Hello, Arthur Knights. Happy Monday. Hope you all of you had a good weekend. Uh, I have your answer from the riddle from Friday, and the question was, what starts with the letter E but only has one letter in it? What starts with the letter E but only has one letter in it? And the answer was an envelope. Uh, today's joke of the day is brought to you by Miss Barry Canoop's son, and his joke is, what do you call a group of people trying to hit a fly? What do you call a group of people trying to hit a fly? The answer is a SWAT team. <laughs> oh my goodness. Thanks to Miss Barry Knoop's son, I have several more jokes of the day uh, from many of you. So thank you for sending those in. Uh, reminder that on Friday, I would like to do a virtual talent show. And I know a lot of you have been sending in pictures and videos of some of the creative talents and hobbies that you guys have. So, uh, I'm very excited to show those on Friday. This weekend, I was also thinking of something that would be really, really fun to do to mix things up in my videos a little bit. And I came up with the idea that this week is going to be college week. Okay. Uh, I know the weather is supposed to be beautiful, so I'm going to get out there and enjoy it by recording these videos around different buildings on the campus of the University of Iowa. Go Hawks! So uh, stay posted for some of those videos. Uh, Friday, I have a really, really special uh, building that I'm going to be recording in front of. A lot of you might have seen this place before, uh, so stay tuned. Today's riddle of the day is David's parents have three children. Two of the children's names are Snap and Crackle. What is the name of the third child? What is the name of the third child? So keep thinking about that. Send me your answers if you would like. Uh, today I would like to encourage all of you to practice another act of kindness but I have some very specific um, directions for you to follow with this one. Uh, I know we have all been encouraged to practice what is known as social distancing, uh, and that can be really, really hard for some people. Um, social distancing means uh, keeping a safe distance away from others so we don't spread um, germs around. So here's what I'm thinking. Uh, we can share kindness with our neighbors that live around us, by uh, writing a note or drawing a picture and leaving it maybe on their front porch or right in front of their door. Um, but make sure you wash your hands really, really, really good uh, before doing this so that way um, we are safe uh, for our neighbors, but we can still practice kindness that way. Uh, so again, if you can leave a, write a note or draw a picture for a neighbor and drop it right in front of their door um, uh, but make sure you're washing your hands really well before and after doing that. Okay. So, um, this week, uh, I continue to put together, uh, a virtual talent show. Um, and then we have some good stuff coming up next week. So that's all I have for you today. Uh, I hope everybody continues to stay, uh, safe and healthy and happy. And I'll talk to you tomorrow.